Hey guys, welcome to the Fighters channel. Former Mexican heavyweight champion Andy Ruiz believes that Britain and Anthony Joshua can take revenge on the Ukrainian WBA, WBO, IBF title holder Alexander Usyk, and even suggested what exactly AJ needs to do. However, Andy will still be drawn at by Usyk. I think Joshua can do it. I think he needs to get into the ring and be aggressive, like at the beginning of his career, Ruiz says. He needs not to let the opponent dictate his terms. I think by exerting pressure, throwing out a lot of combinations, not allowing Usyk to be in the comfort zone and deliver his small, precise blows, Joshua can win. But Usyk is a man of thrust, so I for him. Former heavyweight champion Anthony Joshua can create potential for training and can regain the WBA, IBF, and WBO titles in a rematch with Alexander Usyk. Former absolute world champion in this weight make Tyson believes. Usyk is an elite amateur boxer, Tyson said in an interview with Joe Rogan. He has the same amateur boxing style that spoils everything for the likes of Joshua, because there are too many movements. And Joshua is not really an amateur boxer. He can do a lot, so he never loses hope, Tyson added of Joshua. He can learn a lot, he is still learning. That's why Joshua is dangerous, because he is still learning. Joshua has to learn how to throw more punches. You can't just move. Jab has to work constantly, and he has to turn it into turning more. Joshua needs to pick up the pace. Not much, a little. He has a hell of a potential. Tyson said about what Joshua should do in a rematch with Usyk. Mike Tyson also tried to explain the skepticism toward Joshua from American boxing fans. Anthony Joshua is not an easy opponent. He suggests that for some reason we expect too much from Joshua. Perhaps because the British support him so much. Americans accept a lot from Joshua. He is going to have a great life after boxing because he is a great guy, Mike Tyson said. Friends, before starting to watch this video, I would like to ask you to subscribe to my channel. If you really enjoy the content, then please subscribe to my channel and keep watching the videos. If you are subscribed, then receive notifications about the release of new videos. You do not even have to look for anything personally. I really want to get 10,000 subscribers. I'm trying very hard absolutely every day and I need your support. Thank you so much. The famous trainer Teddy Atlas commented on the result of the fight of the British Tyson Fury and Dillian White. Fury knocked out his opponent in the sixth round and defended the WBC world title. After the fight, his opponent said that he was in a cow because of the illegal actions of Yuri, who allegedly pushed him. According to White, he hit his head hard on the canvas. Sometimes heavyweight fights are discussed too loudly, and extra hype is created. But in account, save this fight. First of all, I want to say that Fury was very well prepared. At the same time, it should be noted how bad Dylan White was. Instead of talking about a push, he should think about poor preparation. He wasn't ready for such a fight. All the specialists were there in his corner did a bad job. When faced with a dominant opponent, you need to use jabs. That's what Mike Tyson did when he fought taller guys. He reacted very patiently. He waited for the moment for the uppercut. It was the first uppercut on the evening that he threw out. Why well, didn't even see all this danger? The coach said. Bob Arams, a promoter of the WBC heavyweight champion Tyson Fury, discussed the potential fights of the world with Alexander Usyk and Anthony Joshua. I don't know which fight is more tempting for Fury, with Usyk or with Joshua. I don't know much about Joshua because I never meet or talk to him, but Usyk is my friend. Probably a fight with Joshua will be more tempting for Fury, because he is also British. I don't think this fight is bigger than with Usyk. Usyk will be the best boxer Fury has ever fought. I'm never sure how Tyson would have reacted to that. There is an opinion in boxing that a good big guy will beat a good little guy. He will need to look. But Usyk is an outstanding fighter. Anthony Joshua is a very good boxer, but hardly outstanding, Aaron said. Thanks for watching, guys. If you like this video, please subscribe to my channel.